Number 57. From the phase diagram for carbon dioxide, which is this figure right here, figure 10.34, we need to determine the state of carbon dioxide, which is CO2, at negative 80 degrees Celsius and 1,500 kilopascals. Okay, so this graph may be a little intimidating, but I promise you it's not. This is just showing you the different states in which uh, carbon dioxide can exist, and it goes by the different colorings. This lighter purple is the region in which carbon dioxide will be a solid. The lavender color is the liquid, carbon dioxide liquid, and majority of it is going to be gas. And up here is called SCF, which is supercritical fluid. So we'll get to that if we need to. But all we're doing here is just plotting a point. Our x-axis is temperature in degrees Celsius. Our y-axis is pressure, kilopascals. And they gave us that we want to look for negative 80 degrees Celsius. So that's our X coordinate. And we want to look for 1500 or 1500 kilopascals. That's our Y coordinate. So we basically just have a point, negative 80 comma 1500. It doesn't really matter where you start. I guess I'll start with the temperature. So we got to look for negative 80 on the X axis. I know that negative 80 has to be in between negative 50 and negative 100. And the middleman right here between 50 and 100 is negative 75. So I know that negative 80 is probably going to be a little bit more farther this way. Let's pretend it's right here. And we don't have to know exactly where negative 80 is. We just have to estimate appropriately. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to draw a straight line up just to show that, okay, this, you know, this is all the, the criteria in which we would be at negative 80 degrees Celsius. Now we have to find 1,500 um, on this side, right? The pressure side, the y-axis. So here's 1,000, and now I'm going up to 10,000. So I know that there's like 10, 10 other, well, I guess nine other thousands in between, so if the first one was like 2,000, 1,500 is probably going to be close to the 1,000 mark. So somewhere over here. Once again, we don't have to be exact. I will put a line straight through. But the idea here is that your point is where X marks the spot. And that's right here where the two lines meet. And because of that, it will be able to tell you what state carbon dioxide will exist in at this temperature and pressure. And we're in the dark blue area, that's carbon dioxide solid. So at negative 80 degrees and 1500 kilopascals, carbon dioxide will be a solid. And that's it. Let's color it in. But pretty, pretty easy. What do th you guys think? Okie dokie. Uh, thanks for viewing the video. Hopefully this helped. Good luck on all your tests and quizzes. And I will talk to you in future lessons. Have an awesome day. Bye-bye.